According to the passage, the phenomenon of olfactory adaptation may cause individuals who are re-exposed to an odorous environment after an extended absence to, to do what? What's going on here? We look here at line number seven. It is commonly reported that following extended absences from the odorous environment, re-exposure may still fail to elicit perception of the original intensity, meaning you leave an area, a smelly area, let's say a garbage dump, go away for a while and you go back, you would think, oh, stinky garbage, maybe, but it's not as intense. Again, it says re-exposure may still fail to elicit perception of the original intensity. So, hold me quickly on answer choice B, perceive the odor as being less intense than it was on first exposure. Now, you look here at answer choice B, exhibit a decreased tolerance for the odorous environment. This could be an alluring answer because of the word decreased. But what is decreased here? They're saying is tolerance. So the idea here is if you're tolerant, you can put up with it more. That is, you're less aware of how stinky it is, which is a case of increased tolerance. So had demon exhibited increased tolerance for the odorous environment, that would make more sense. But here it's saying, Decreased tolerance, the garbage dump has even become smellier the second time around, which clearly is not saying, so we can get rid of the answer choice D. Again, the answer is B.